welcome uh, sa Agno Compound dito sa Nasal. <laughs> isa sa pinakamasayang atletang Pinoy sa linggong ito, isa sa champions ng DLSU Green Archers, si Francis Escandor, who did a great job in Game 2 for this final series. No? But before we talk about that game, I, wanna, I want you to take me through your thoughts from Game 1. No? After the 30-point loss leading into Game 2, what, was your, what were you thinking and what was your mindset? Um, well, first of all, no Game 1, I think everyone saw how bad our loss was mm -hmm. and from there parang me and my teammates also we just took took it personal parang the training leading up to game two it was it was pretty physical it was pretty brutal and parang it showed na each and every one of us did not like that win and right. i think eventually in game two we really wanted to bounce back and i think we showed na from that from there on we did and eventually right. and hence the results in game two results, no? yeah. so after that game how were you i mean that was such a great day for you yeah i mean honestly of course i was happy but then again the job wasn't finished because we still had mm -hmm. game three mm -hmm. but overall after the game two um i was really really happy especially because we had momentum coming into game three and eventually yeah winning the championship all right, your family was here? Yeah, their family they, they was came here. From everyone, Davao. yeah, yeah everyone, and, family, friends. And relatives and relatives, everyone, they're yeah. all in the Okay, uh, after game two, getting to game three naman, no? Yeah. Uh, kamusta kayo? What, what, uh, was, what, what was the one thing that Coach Topic said that got that was stuck to your head? Um, basically, yeah, he said, yun din, na, job's not finished. We still need one more win. Um, we came this far and it's hard to turn back now. So, mm -hmm. parang andito na kami. So, kukunin na namin. Yun yung sinabi ni Coach Topek sa amin. And coming into Game 3, we, were, we really, really had high hopes. Saying na kaya natin to, kukunin na natin to, huwag na natin ibigay. I've been meaning to ask, was this always your dream? Or did you have another sport before basketball? Um, honestly, it's, it's always been my dream. Especially to play for La Salle. Mm -hmm. Ever since I was a kid, um, me and my dad, we would always watch like UAP games, especially La Salle games. Um, during the 2016 championships, we were there. We witnessed the championship of La Salle. And from then on, like the dream was alive, saying that I want to play for La Salle. And eventually it came full circle. How old were you then? I was probably like 16. 14. I was I was when still you, in Davao. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then everything and then came after. Yeah. Okay, your dad also plays basketball? Uh, he used to, he used to, but not not professionally, no. Okay. Yeah. You know, ang dami mong fans na mga bata, no? I know you also <laughs> went to Zobel. Oh, yeah, yeah, I did. What I did is one thing you want to tell them? Anong, anong pwede mong masabi or ma-advise sa kanila kung paano mapupunta kung nasan ka ngayon? Um, just to all to all the fans, just and like to all the basketball players, to ins just keep just keep being inspired, keep keep fighting for that, for your dreams, no matter what happens, well, no matter what people says, um, nothing is impossible, and I can I can testify to that, and I'm very very blessed, and just keep just keep working each and every day. Hey, maraming salamat, uh, thank Francis you. Escandor. Thank you. Welcome uh, sa Agno Compound dito sa Arasal. Hey. Ako si Benjamin Phillips, Kuya Ben. Hey, what's up? I'm Mark Nanoy of the LSU Green Archers. <laughs> this is our kitchen where all of our food is prepared uh, very well for us. Set up yung pagayin dito and then make sure that we're fed as champions. Come on in. So this is where we usually have our meals. Uh, together as a team, tapos yung practice or tapos yung games namin. Uh, yung ate, saka yung mga kuya, sarap yung pagkain, nagluluto araw-araw sa amin. So, it's really, really uh, a blessing here at the South that we're well-fed, well-nourished, and well-protected. Come on in. Oi! Champ, champ. Hey, champ. Hey, champ. This is not Josh. Josh David, DJ Cyrus Estrella. <laughs> hey! <laughs> and this is uh, Brother Felipe. Hi! Just passed by and I'm happy to see the team here. And this is the one who keeps everything here together. This is Ate. She Hello. makes sure everything is, is prepared for us. Don't forget your brothers. Ah, see, and I was, of course, uh, see, see Isaiah, yung, yung birthday niya. 
Uh, and then this is uh, T. Mike, Wonder Mike. So thank you, Ate, for always feeding us and taking care of us. Uh, thank you, Ate. Chicken breast. Chicken breast. Lahat chicken breast. Shrimp. Eggs. Oh, Eggs. 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 Pwede na ngayon. Ano yun? Ano yun? Ano yun? Crispy pata. Wala din po. Wala din po. Soft cream. Wala din po. Ice cream. Wala din po. Pa, depende. Pag mayroong party, pag may birthday, may ice cream sila. Nagpaano kami sa kanya pag may party lang. Okay. Hindi natin mga palang magaganda ang mga katawa nila. Pero ano sila discipline? Discipline sila sa diet nila. Kanya naman ang champion. Ay, yes, eh. Ano naman ang pakiramdam mo? Happy! So usually after we have a, a good meal, it's on uh, lunch or yung merienda. Sometimes we like to get a, a lift in either before or after practice. So come with us to see our weight room. So usually it's really nice here to say that mean players, dito saka mga coaches. So it's really one one family talaga. So after practice, we'll all come together. We'll all stay around here. Meron ano? Meron yung court dito, so yung extra shooting or dribbling skills kasi mga mga players. Number one talaga. Oh, ah, si the coach. Coach Topex, champion coach. This is our one of our team coasters. Uh, so whether we're traveling to practices or mga tournaments on the bus, uh, we we always make sure we have our daily style bus. So that yung ano yung yung feeling talaga when all of us are together there, because that mean kwentuhan or, or or times that we really enjoy each other's company. So one team, one family, and there's a lot of memories on this bus. Hey, mami miss namin yan. Oh, this bus. So come with us into our weight room. This is where the sauce gets made. So in no, 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 2020, ako, uh, this is where I started, this is where all of us started, it's a weight room. Um, salamat sa Coach Marlin, uh, Coach Miggs, Coach Yellow, lahat yung strength conditioning coaches. You see the progress of sila, uh, MVP Kevin Kiambao, he was in here every day, two, three times a day. And we have all of our the weights that we need. So we have a dumbbell rack, we have a squat rack, we have pull-up bars, resistance bands. It's really everything that you need here to perform at your highest caliber as a De La Salle athlete. <laughs> yeah, hey. Woo. Hey. Dang, bro, that was written all the way back. That, that was KQ. Jeez. Yeah. This was written by KQ before the preseason, though. No? Even before the preseason. February. He, he kind of snuck up on us, but let's just take a moment to, to welcome our coach, Coach Topex. He, uh, he, he, you know, he's, he's, he's really the architect. And then uh, Jung and Jung, Jung Daming assistant coaches. Uh, Idol Topex. Oh, see, Idol Topex. So, in the vision of all of our assistant coaches, we were able to, to bring the crown back to Taft. So we're really thankful to have him and all of the players here. Uh, hopefully, you know, we will we'll be looking to bring some more uh, banners and crowns back here. But under Coach Topex's leadership and, and vision, you know, we're going to follow him all the way. Uh, gusto lang namin kayo uh, welcome dito. Dito po kami nag uh, but uh, after game or after training namin, dito po kami nag uh, but and uh, sobrang saya kasi yung mga memories na lang lahat, yung mga ano mo lang kasi yun nga, yung band namin nasa team. Kahit dito, nag-aventuhan, nag-aasaran. So, 
sobrang may miss na namin yung mga place na kung saan kami nag kung saan kami comforta comfortable and then uh, wala uh, worth it lahat ng hirap namin kaya ngayon champion na kami oh yes sir <laughs> Actually, this, these trees right here are over 100 years old. These are super historic trees. I remember we were in, this is, this is the practice court we had in the bubble. We, even if it rained, naalala mo yun mo. Kahit umulan, dito kami nag-practice. Lahat ng tinakirapan namin dito sa bubble, sa season 84. So, but definitely, every time we see, uh, nikita mo yung net, sira na sira. Super, uh, Dumbing memories Zita. So now we'll go up. This is uh, some of the rooms. We call this the new house. So we have some rooms here on the, on the, on the first floor. But we'll go up to Kuya Ben, Captain Ben's room. And we'll do a, a room raid with Kuya Ben. We'll get to see King Sancha Magporma. Lahat ng suits niya, lahat ng mga outfits niya. Actually, these arrows were from the pandemic. This is when we had all these protocols, and man, so many memories here. All right, Ben, you can take it away. So welcome to uh, my room here. Actually, I graduated from college back in the States. And the main thing that I was really blessed and thankful for when I came to La Salle, especially as a Philan coming from the States, was how nice the accommodations are here. I mean, it really makes you feel like you're back home. This is similar to a college dorm, even back in the States. It reminds me of my, uh, my old college days. So come on in while I show you my room. We have a uh, Wi-Fi here. Oh, absolutely. When we had online classes in the bubble, we would practice here, then go up here and take our classes in, inside. So shout out to Coach Gian for, for really <laughs> hooking us up with the Wi-Fi so we can take our online classes just in our beds and in our desks in our room. So if you want to come on in here, I'll show you a little bit of the room. Uh, so I'm a, I'm a big gamer and a, and, a, and a big student and a big uh, business guy. So I have my, my setup here. I run everything on usually my, my desktop, whether it's my classes, you manga classes, you manga business school, or even sometimes video games. Uh, team. This is where we all watch movies, play video games. Uh, sometimes I can, you know, if I have a break, I like to, to do a lot of music. So I'm on the piano a lot or or uh, you know play guitar Bogey up. And, uh, Bogey. <laughs> that was uh, that's that's my graduation picture uh, I recently graduated with my my master's in business administration currently I'm a doctoral of uh, business administration student, so I'm trying to get my doctorate but this is just uh, where where everything is you know your, your peace and your solace away from from practices or away from everything you know they make everything really really accommodatable here um, and if so you want to know who stole all of Pat Dabao's cookies it's Kuya Ben. Now, now, now. Those are the captain. Those you are the no cookies. Championship cookies. That's yeah. for the team, but it's <laughs> sa Kuya Ben. Lahat. <laughs> hey, Kuya ben lahat. Uh, people always ask, you know, what does your closet look like? Uh, so, this is usually where I keep all of my, my suits. I uh, mix and match them and, and a lot of my, you know, my different accessories and my ties. And uh, the one thing when I first got here, I just wanted one uh, LaSalle jersey. That was, that was my goal. And, and now uh, they're just overflowing at the bottom. You know, we have a, uh, just a bunch of practice jerseys, team jerseys. Um, they, they really, really take care of us here, and it's such a blessing to be a part of such an esteemed institution like LaSalle. So that's my room. I go. hope that, uh, oh, I actually, card. I'm, a, I'm an old head. I'm uh, a old head. I'm an old head. I'm lifetime uh, alumni cards at De La Salle. So uh, hopefully everybody, whether you graduate or, or you're coming back to finish your studies, you get your alumni association card so you can always be a part of the Lasallian family. Uh, so brang thankful and, and blessed to make us say we're we're a part of the Adidas family and uh, for us it really is so wonderful because they always take care of us. Impossible is nothing with the Adidas family. So these are just some of the, uh, the the shoes that you know we've been blessed to kind of accumulate over over the years since we've been a part of the family. So these were actually uh, season eighty four, season eighty four, eighty five, eighty eight five, eighty five, season eighty five. These are the shoes that me and my brother would always match and wear together on the court. Um, these are the salad suit. Yeah, these are the actually these are the old. 
St. Vincent, St. Mary, um, you know, uh, LeBron school shoes. So, I know, when I'm in stories with my shoes, uh, you know, these are the shoes that I wore when I was with Gilas, and there's a lot of different stories with all of these shoes, and I'm a big anime and, and video game nerd as well. Um, so, you know, this is just kind of just a, a recollection of all the hard work that we put in, and we've just been blessed to, to really have, and hopefully we can share with a lot of people. Um, so, that's the room tour, and I hope you liked it. Thank you.